Hello everyone! A while back I did an experiment using loofah sponges to grow radishes and to my surprise the seeds germinated really nicely on the loofah. Someone in the comments asked about using cotton and someone else said they use it for school projects in Egypt and so I had to try it. I got myself some jumbo cotton balls and some rock wool and set up six cubes of rock wool and six cotton balls. And I'm going to plant these with my favorite lettuce seeds. It says here on the back the normal germination time is 7 to 10 days and 45 days to harvest. So let's get these started. The first thing I did was to saturate both the rock wool and the cotton balls in water. I let them soak for a couple of hours and now they are ready for the seeds. You can see why this variety is called Black Seeded Simpson. Now to get these seeds planted one by one I take a toothpick and dip one end in water to get it a little wet and then the seeds stick to the end of the toothpick. Trust me this is a lot easier than using my fingers. So I went ahead and placed one seed in each hole in the rock wool and one seed on each cotton ball. Sometimes I use two seeds when I'm not sure how fresh the seeds are but this packet has been giving me an almost 100% germination rate, so I'm just planting one per cube. Here you can see six balls of cotton on the left and six Rockwell cubes on the right, and all have one seed planted on or in them. Then I carefully poured some water in the bottom of the tray so that the cotton balls and the Rockwell would stay hydrated. And then I put the tray into a plastic bag. Sometimes I cover my trays with plastic wrap. Either way works. The idea is to provide a nice humid environment for the seeds to germinate. Now it's two days later. I set these up on a Friday and today is Sunday and it may be hard to see but the seeds on the cotton balls have little tails so they're all starting to sprout. The seeds on the rock wool are down in a hole so it's hard to see but I think I can see some sprouts in there as well. Now it's Tuesday, day four, and all the seeds seem to have germinated. I don't see any difference between the cotton balls and the rock wool. Now it's Thursday, day six, and all the lettuce seedlings look fine. When the water runs out, I add some more to the tray, just plain water. I haven't introduced nutrients into the water yet. And here we are on day 9 and the seedlings look great. A side by side comparison of the biggest seedling from each group shows them to be of equal size. I don't see any difference here. In fact all of the cotton ball seeds germinated. One of the Rockwell seeds is questionable. We'll see what happens to that one. I'm going to transplant these into a hydroponic setup and see if the end result is also the same. But at this point I can say there was no difference between using rock wool or cotton balls to germinate these lettuce seeds. Both produce nice seedlings. Once they get a root coming out from the bottom, I'll move them to a crack key setup and keep following to see if anything changes. But at this point it looks like the cotton balls are a great alternative to the rock wool. So go ahead and try using them instead of rock wool. And thank you to Morrow93 for the great idea. I hope you enjoyed this short but interesting experiment. Thank you for watching. Bye.